Hey everybody, this is Don over Johnny's Used Cars. Today I'm going to show you this 2010 Nissan Tita. It's got 75,500 75, kilometers on it, which is about 45, 46,000 miles. Let's take a look around. We'll show you the features inside on this beautiful, warm, sunny day. Uh, this Tita is a five passenger vehicle in the 500 series category. Road tax per year is going to be 7,500 yen, which is about $68 right now with the current exchange rate. Sorry, can't get the angle here. Sorry, just hit my pole pole here. Road tax is due every April May time frame. So you get this from us, we'll go ahead and take care of it for this year. You won't have to worry about it till next year. It was recommended to me that I should mention about uh, our financing. You can pay cash outright for this, or you can take advantage of zero percent financing for 24 months with zero down. Okay, uh, just come on in. We'll give you the details. Now before we go inside, I always like showing you the, um, the uh, rain guards here. This will allow you to roll the window down a few inches. This way if it rains, you're not going to get it wet inside. But also more importantly, uh, in the summer as we're experiencing now, it's going to uh, give you that cross ventilation, okay, to take that extremely hot air out. And also get, you, get yourself a good windshield visor. That's going to help keep this inside a lot cooler. Anything to keep the dash cooler is going to cool down the car a lot quicker because it is like a sauna in here. All right, so it does have the... Um, the keyless here, so as long as it's on your person, you're going to just crank it over. Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm sorry, I gotta roll down these windows just for now. All right, 75,000, let's turn this off, sorry, Troy. 75,458 on the odometer. Uh, show you a couple of warning lights. Show you this uh, green one down there before it goes away. That is your uh, new temperature gauge. So it's gonna be green when the engine's cool. When the engine warms up, it's gonna uh, turn off and it'll be red if it's overheating, so be on the lookout for that. The one to the top left of that is your emergency brake. Okay, it's not a low pressure tire gauge, we get that a lot. But it is a kick tight, so when you kick it, disengage it goes away, kick it again, comes right back on. And I'm thinking you can see a couple of silhouettes of the other warning lights. Um, and then one over here, uh, along with a couple of other silhouettes, that's your obviously your seatbelt one. Wear your seatbelts out here, they do give tickets on and off base. But if any of those uh, warning lights come on while you're driving, please pull over, find out what it is, take the necessary action. Other than that, just simple instrument cluster straight ahead. Off to the left here, we do have a little storage right here. Your radio, little storage again under that, and then your uh, air conditioning controls. You do have your cup holders here, your shifter. These are controls to uh, work the seat, okay? Uh, power outlet and a little storage right there, and you do have your armrest, okay? Let me make sure the seat, yeah, the seat's all the way back now. Continuing off to the left, it does have a deep pocket, um, hopefully you can see that, um, a deep pocket glove box. And you do have storage and a cup holder in the door panels, okay? That's your passenger space over there with that red road flare hanging out. And this is my space over here, okay? Um, I'm 5'11", as everybody loves knowing. Um, I could drive with it yeah, like this or even slide it up a couple inches and still be comfortable driving. Um, it does have a uh, sunglass uh, compartment little uh, storage right there and then what else you got your uh, mirror controls right there as well so let's take uh, eye level yeah I feel like I'm sitting up really high but you still can't see past the, um, the wipers okay all the way back all right I'd like to take this time to show you the uh, the auction sheet okay it was graded number four so it has not been in any accidents okay and we keep this not only to give you peace of mind knowing that it hasn't been in any accidents, but it's also good to show the next potential buyer after two to three years if, if you've had no accidents uh, that the vehicle hasn't been in any, okay? So right down here on the bottom of the dash, please don't forget the right side, that's your gas cover release and this is your hood release. So I'm going to pull this one and we'll show you the, uh, under the hood here in a second. I'm going to turn this off, keep the windows down while I'm still going in here. Because as you'll see, it's like a sauna in these cars. Now this is a um, half mixed uh, cloth and I call it pleather because it's not real leather, okay? Now with that seat all the way back, all the way down, you can see that it's a little uh, more reclined than the other one. Uh, I'm still a good four or five inches uh, away from the back of the seat uh, to my knees. Uh, nothing as far as uh, storage on the back of the driver's side, but on the passenger side they do have the pocket and just a little bit of storage. I don't know what you're going to put in there on each door panel. Um, no ashtray, just a little compartment here and then it does have an armrest with your cup holders okay and this does go through to the trunk so if you have to slide something uh, that's a little skinnier uh, through there then you have that extra space let's go to the trunk 
And for a mid-sized car, this actually is a, has some decent space in it. And it does have the uh, button that you can open up uh, from the outside, all right? I got total glare on my phone, so I don't even know if I'm getting that right. Hopefully I am. But you see how deep it is. It's a really, really nice size trunk. And these cars, they might not be the most stylish, but they are very economical. They'll get you to point A, point B, no problem. Good on gas, etc. All around a well-built car. And then you got your engine compartment. Again, hopefully I'm showing that to you. All right, so 2010 Nissan Tita. Uh, 75 and a half thousand kilometers on it, which is about 45, 46,000 miles. Military price goes down to 4,200. With the additional military discount, we'll get this down to 4,000. That 4,000 is going to include the uh, two-year JCI, the one-year bumper-to-bumper full warranty, the 2021 road tax, and the 10% sales tax already included. Only thing on top will be your American insurance requirement. That's whether you're going liability or full coverage, and it's based on your pay grade and age. But it's totally up to you. If you've had no uh, accident, or I'm, I'm sorry, if you've had no claims with the previous insurer for the last three years, please let us know. We might be able to get you a discount on your new insurance policy here. As always, I uh, highly encourage you to uh, shop around, see what other places have, and come out to Johnny's Used Cars, let us show what we have here. Uh, if you have any questions while you're out and about, I think you're not getting the right information, go ahead and contact us. Our contact information is below. We're always willing to assist you regardless if you're buying a car from us or not. Okay, so if you're on your phone, click the title of the video. That'll take you to YouTube so you can see the information for yourself. Or if you're on our website, it's there. Or you click the YouTube icon on the bottom right of the video. That'll take you there as well. All right? Uh, so again, you can pay cash outright or take advantage of the 0% financing uh, for 24 months and zero down. Okay, so thank you very much for watching. Take care. Hope to see you soon.